Hello everybody, this is Cinema77 once again, and uh, I wanted to make a quick video on this show, Haunting. Is he on Discovery Channel? Now, I'm not even sure if this show is even still on or not. Um, I know they did a season 8, which hasn't been released to DVD yet or anything. So I don't even know. I don't know if there's a season 9 or 10 or anything. Um, but, um, you know, I just want to take a minute to talk about what a great show this is. And um, this actually came out like around the time when you started getting all these shows, you know, Ghost Hunters, Ghost Adventures, Paranormal State, all these other shows and everything else. And kind of the biggest difference, though, between this one and other ones is that this one here is extremely well done. It's mostly it's it's um, accounts of people who experience real hauntings and demon possessions, ghost possessions. Um, and uh, the way the show is done, it's really well made. It's genuinely scary. The atmosphere is creepy. And... I just fell in love with the show because there were times I watched it and I was genuinely creeped out by it. And that doesn't happen very often. But, you know, in this heyday of now all these shows where it's always, you know, people going into, you know, some haunted place or place that's supposed to be haunted. And they're just, you know, hey, ghost, you know, yeah, come on, ghost, bring it. Come on, bring it, ghost. Come out, mess with me. Come on, come on, you dicks. Come on, come on, mess with me. I just thought this show was so much better done and this is, you know, the stories are interesting because they're kind of, they're all different kinds of stories and, and uh, you can see this is a big fat pack and it has seasons one, two, three, and four and um, it's a nine disc set. Okay. But see, here's the thing though. It's like, all right, there is a, uh, a little bit of a difference. See, you know, you got the, what I did was. This show was actually inspired by a documentary called A Haunting in Connecticut. And A Haunting in Connecticut, they turned around, they did a, the documentary came out, and then they made a sequel to the documentary called A Haunting in Georgia. And then they turned around, they made a movie version of um, Haunting in Connecticut, which is nowhere near as good as the documentary. I strongly suggest, you know, if, if you ever see Haunting in Connecticut, it's like, you, know, you could watch the movie, but I think you'd be much better if you just watched the documentary. But anyway, though, this is a nine disc set. This disc here actually was separate. I bought this separately, and I just thought, well, to help save space, you know, there's a place for it. So I'll just put it in here with the rest of it because it all goes together. So, but, um, so they did the documentary, you know, Haunting in Connecticut, Haunting in Georgia, and they're both really, really good. And like I said, they're, you know, genuinely scary. So then they decided to do the show and then, you know, so now you got like season one and, you know, it shows you everything that's on there. The episodes, you know, the Lake Club Horror, the Haunting of Summerland, Hill, Hell House, Curse, Echoes from the Grave. And you got, you know, like all these here, you know, Darkness Follows, Gateway to Hell, The Diabolical, Demon Child, Sally's House, you know, and so on. But, um. Yeah, this, this set here, I think there's another set of it that you can get. But this set here, I think, has been discontinued. This one here is not easy to find anymore, but uh, but I think they do have a separate set that you can get now. But but anyway, though, yeah, I just, when I saw this, um, I sprang for it, and I really love having this box set, and it's really good. It's a really good show. And then here in 2012... This was, it says here the 2012 season, but this really is season five. And was it this one or was it the other one? So, okay, this one was the two. Disc. Okay, so it was season six was the really small season. But yeah, this one here, this, this was a pretty good season two. And then season six, this was the really small one, the notoriously small season for whatever reason. See, it only says there you only got four episodes. So, for whatever reason, why? But they were still good. Then, season seven, which I'm glad to have. And, like I said, there is a season eight, but as far as I know, that hasn't been released to, uh, to DVD yet or anything like that. I think you can stream it on some places, but... 
right now, this is it. These are the nine seasons of Haunting, and I'm really happy to have it. And I strongly suggest if you, you know, if you like shows about ghost stories and stuff like that. And I mean, granted, it's reenactments. It's you know, people talking about experiences that they've had living in haunted houses and things like that. But you know, there are some genuinely creepy moments and some very scary things going on in this show. So I recommend give it a shot. And if you know, if you're just kind of tired of all the, uh, you know, just people, you know. Kind of like South Park does, you know, where somebody goes into a, you know, where ghost hunters goes in there. And what was that? What was that? What was that? You see that? What was that? What was that? You know, if you kind of get tired of that kind of thing, I strongly suggest give a haunting a try. And, you know, for my money, it really is one of the best um, shows about ghosts you can ever watch. So, but anyway, that's going to pretty much wrap up this video. And I hope season eight comes soon because I do want it. And if they keep making more, I'm probably going to want those too. So. But anyway, though, that's going to end this video. This is uh, Cinema 77, horror and cult film lover, and I hope you love a haunting as much as I do. And uh, um, if you watched this video and you liked it, thank you very much for taking the time to watch it. And if you liked it, please like and subscribe, and uh, I'll see you later. Bye-bye.